Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Raymond Arity and welcome back to my Let's Play of Ape Escape 2. In the last episode, we handed people cheat over to the professor and caught some black monkeys. Now, I've got the gotcha box here. I believe these are based on the like, gachapon machines or whatever they're called from Japan. You like put some money in, you turn a capital and you get like a little prize. In this case, it's secret fo you can get secret photos, you can get concept art, you can get cookies, you can get extra lives, and you can get a few other things from them as well, such as mini games for that mini game center that we skimmed over. Well, by skimmed over, I mean we just walked right past in the last episode. So yeah, we've got this remote control car here, and I'm gonna just go through the gadget trainer very quick. I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna listen to any of the tutorials, I don't believe, well, I might. But I'll just see how they are. I just, uh, all right. I'll just guide my car around, and then yeah, hit these two. Then I gotta head up the stairs uh, with the thing, and oh, it's not coming up the stairs. I gotta learn how to get this thing up. Uh, hold on. Uh, oh there. I might have to listen to a tutorial after all. So I'm just gonna um, like look at the phone. Uh, and then, uh, oh wait, no, I could just press R3 uh, and get it through. Oh, wait, too late. Yeah, activate switches, drive over the thing. It'll, if you click R3, then you get uh, then you get the thing back. So I'm just going to head up these stairs and head straight for the next level. I'm not going to dawdle around any longer. I'm just going to get right into the ninja hideout, which is obviously Japan. Go up and capture 12 monkeys. All right, that should be... An easy enough task. Um, yeah, they're all over the place here. And as you can see, this level is very obviously Japanese inspired because this is a Japanese game. You might have been able to tell. Let's just, yeah, get, take care of these enemies. Then I, I'm going to assign the uh, remote control car to the circle button, just like with the catapult, just like with the monkey radar. Gotta let this monkey climb through here and then oh, I missed the timing to catch him because I was too close to the cage. So now I've got to chase him around for a bit and see what I can do. Uh, best thing to do, go for the dash hoop, then catch him like that and then you're done. So now i just got to run all the way back over here and hmm, this monkey looks off. Oh, this statue looks suspicious and yeah, it's a monkey. He can't go very fast. So what do I do? I catch him. And now I just gotta click R3, put the thing through here, the RC car, it'll go through automatically, then dump this bucket on this monkey's head, and he'll run away, and I will just catch him right now. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes it's very odd. Sometimes you can see under the level when you uh, when you catch a monkey, at like there, like, uh, oh, I got another bullet for another type of ammunition for my, for my catapult. I'm not going to use that much in this level. Uh, I just got to get this black monkey down from here. I think he's a black monkey. It's going to be hard to get him down from there now. Uh, yeah, I just got to get him down here. Uh, right, so, okay, he's not coming out. Yeah, this is going to be more difficult than I first thought. And, yes, I got him. Now I just have to get catch him with this net, and he's mine. Yeah. All right, I've got nearly half the monkeys in this level in this first section alone. I'm pretty impressed. Uh, now I just have to jump up here and go to get the bridge down to open the next section. Uh, so I'm going to switch back to my catapult and then look over and aim. Where's the switch? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, yeah, there's another monkey down there. Okay, I get you. That's probably where it is. Just got to head down here. Swim across, catch that monkey. It'll be easy because look, there's not much space on the platform. Yeah, and I catch him immediately. Uh, his name is Chan. He's in Japan. Funny. Uh, okay, the bridge lowers. We can now cross that moat, and then uh, then I'll be in the. Uh, sh I can't remember. I think it, I'll just call it a castle for now. Yeah, I think, yeah, it's just a cat, or, oh wait, no, I remember now, it's a pagoda. It's a pagoda. Just have to catch one of these ninja monkeys. Actually, yeah, it's, it, it would be a ninja, because it's wearing the correct colors, like, dark blue. Because black would be too visible at night. Black would be, and uh, dark blue, like, you blend in really well. That's why 
the ninja the ninjas actually wore that now just gotta switch back to the rc car and just go uh make sure this button hit monkey hits this button but oh god he blew up the car so i gotta get another one and then put it on the switch walk in and then ca catch the monkey luckily he's uh oh wait gotcha ah you, you thought you were smart but you were not and now just gotta go up here there's only four monkeys left i think there's one uh boom yeah, there's one right there. Just gotta sneak up behind him. And yeah, do that. Catch him right there. Only three left. That's very good. Gotta hit this switch here. And then I gotta go in and find the next monkey. I think it might be through this door, but it might be actually... Oh, the switch. Okay, I'll, I'll hit that switch and then walk through the door and see what's on the other side. Hopefully another monkey. Oh, wait, no, never mind. There's one here. Uh, just gotta catch him. Yeah, that's easy done. Hideyoshi. Um, and there's... Uh, okay, wow. This Okay, uh, there's like a mini pagoda inside the pagoda. Just gotta lower it here with this... With these with the switch, which moves the cogs. Which allows me to catch him instantly. Uh, now there's only one left, and he's over here. Just gotta put this RC car through here. Then I gotta go over and hit the button. Make sure it doesn't slip off the button. Uh, uh, oh god damn it, he destroyed the car, so I have to put it on the button again. This is all... Yeah, this is uh, not going great. Uh, oh yeah, actually, I'm going to announce... In, uh, my upload schedule starting from next week will be Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Because uh, college is going to get very uh, very intense for me. Like It's going to start kick, picking off very soon. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to exit this level see how many types of monkeys we caught and then I'll stop because believe it or not the next boss fight is coming up right now Alright, this is Uki Yellow, the, uh, the sumo wrestler. Uh, we just slam him into these spikes to damage him. In the North American release of Ape Escape 2, he's voiced by James Carter Cathcart, who was the voice of Gary Oak and Meowth in the Pokemon... Well, he was voiced by mainly Gary Oak in Pokemon, Weevil Underwood in Yu-Gi-Oh! and Vector the Crocodile in the Sonic franchise. For when four kids had it. Yeah, um... Yeah, he's, he's, uh, he's a sumo and you can't damage him normally, you have to put him on these spikes. I can't remember the exact name of them, but these are the kinds of spikes ninjas use in uh, feudal Japan uh, during Sengoku Jidai period, or maybe after Sengoku Jidai, I'm not sure. Haven't fully done a fully Japanese history, but yeah, just gotta do this. Best thing to use is the dash hoop, just like Uki Blue. Um, and. Yeah, this boss fight, I think it might be slightly easier than the last one, because I'm not having as hard a time with it. Yeah, he, in fact, he even drops you health and enemies to help you get ammo for your, uh, for the, uh, slingshot, for the, no, not the slingshot, yeah, the catapult. Yeah, so just gotta head over here and then hit him on the spikes again. I believe it's probably five hits, or maybe it's more than five hits now. You can count how many hits it was. To kill Uki Yellow in the comment section below. And I just gotta wait for him to charge again. You can tell when he's charging when he sticks his crotch up like that. And you see his fucking outy belly button. Y yeah, Yellow Monkey. Y Uki Yellow is kind of disgusting, to be honest. Uh, well, sure, he's meant to be a sumo wrestler, but like, he acts kind of gay. And, and you just gotta drop all this stuff down these Daruma dolls. He's, uh, Buck, uh, buckets, these uh, other things, and he does that pose he wants. 
He clearly wants somebody to paint him like one of the fr one of those French women. Uh, just slam him on these spikes, and he's down. Yes, I did it. I beat Uki Yellow. Yo, that really hurt. Don't get too full of yourself just because you won. I was on a diet, you know, so I wasn't eating my right as eat bananas. I couldn't fight well because my stomach was empty. So next time, you better watch out. I'll get you, boy! Ah! Come back! He got away! All right, yeah, we beat you, Kielo. Yeah, he got away. That's so amazing. Yeah! Now back to the travel station to see the the uh, menu and yeah monkey car we got uh, n none because uh, he got away which is kind of concerning considering how powerful these monkeys, monkeys are. Anyways guys this is going to be the end of the episode for all those who are brand new to my channel will you all please like share subscribe comment and follow me on Twitch link to that is in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching this episode of my let's play of Ape Escape 2.